my goal was to make top three and to go 57 and this morning I had a really good morning swim um, I had a couple things I had to work on but going into finals it was I'm a senior so it was my last one to breast I wanted to put everything you know in the water and get out and confidently say that I left it in the pool and I can proudly say that I did that touching the wall you kind of have to pull yourself up on the blocks to see the times and <laughs> my eyes or my brain or one of the two just didn't register what I was looking at and then it registered 57 and I turned and looked at my coach and then I just started crying and the last year especially the last few months I've just so many obstacles and so many things happen out of my control and I'm just so proud of everything that I've accomplished so far more determination more focus um, going from sophomore to junior year I kind of had a chip on my shoulder and this year I was a lot more confident in myself I swam more for myself than to prove things to other people so I was a lot more focused and determined in and out of the water especially in the weight room but yeah so uh, on the way down a train trip I acquired a foot injury um, on the flight my foot swelled and the, my tennis shoe rubbed against the top of my foot so I didn't kick breaststroke for a month and then I was in a boot for two weeks and then <laughs> two weeks before the conference meet I was walking the main campus and I got hit by a car a lady ran a red light and so I missed a couple practices and had a bruise so it was just a bruise luckily yes just a big bruise on the inside of my knee but it was kind of more traumatic than anything <laughs> but just especially with the boot not kicking breast for a month I'm just you know stayed focused stayed determined kept my head held high and just kept going and it all paid off and I'm just very it's so surreal you know obviously I hit second you know I'm gonna be wired tonight I don't think I'm gonna be able to sleep and it'll probably kick in that I actually got second place once I fly back home the two breasts tomorrow, I'm just trying to soak it all in tonight and then, you know, tomorrow I'll wake up and focus on the two breasts. In that event, I've also come a long way. I never swam the 200 breasts before I came to college. Uh, so my freshman year was the first time I ever swam the two breasts. And going in to prelims tomorrow, I'm in a good, I have a good seed time. So hopefully I can have a great prelim swim and make it back in top eight. I think I've had so many amazing opportunities swimming has given me and I've met so many great people and I just think it's time to move on um, and go into the real world and travel a little bit and I'm very thankful for all the opportunities and everything I've accomplished and the people along the way have been there for me but I just think the, as of right now you know things can change but as of right now I think this is it for me.